I welcome you to Iskorn of Pasiphone. As you can see, the outside shell is virtually totally complete now. And as I'll show you inside, so much progress has been made in the last year. So please follow me inside. Um, <coughs> as you will see, now we are making so much rapid progress on the inside. This is the lobby. You can see the lobby is framed. You can see where the elevator is, where the gift shop is where the bathrooms are, where the office is, showroom, etc. So the whole lobby area is pretty much framed out, completed with the beautiful skylight. And as you'll see, we, as we enter into the temple room, a lot of the work in the temple room is also now complete. You can see the framing along the altar there. Your main altar you can see on the sides of the altar. You can see the audiovisual room and the pujari rooms behind the altar. There's wonderful framing already done for the extra large pujai room, gulsi room, deity kitchen, flower room, etc. So you can see that we are progressing so much and you can see all of the mechanical work that's been done. We're starting the electrical work, the plumbing, and in so many areas that this whole temple is now taking such wonderful shape. Um, we, however, having said this, we still have some significant challenges. Um, we still have $160,000 worth of mechanical work that we need to finish. There's roughly a half a million dollars worth of framing work we still need to finish. Um, we need $130,000 to finish the foam insulation all along the walls, outside walls of the whole temple. Um, and uh, several other, $300,000 for our commercial kitchen. So in several other expenses like this, we still have to account for. All in all, we need around $2.2 million. Um, and out of that, we still have around $600,000 remaining in the bank loan, which we can draw. And we have 120,000 or so in cash in our new temple account. This leaves us with a gap of around $1.5 million. And that's why I'm appealing to you today for your support. See, so if we can arrange this funding of $1.5 million, we believe we can have a grand opening for this wonderful new temple as early as Ram Nomi in 2024. How exciting would that be to welcome our Sri Sri Gornitai deities, Sri Sri Radha Krishna deities from uh, India, our brand new altar, which is also getting finishing touches, gold leaf, and getting ready to ship here. Um, so in this way, we, we can really get this temple operational very, very soon with your support. And Nilmanipu, what do you have in the phase one of the project? In phase one, as you see, we have the lobby, we have the temple room, all of the whole entire floor behind the temple room. We have downstairs our commercial kitchen. And on the left side, we have the entire wing. On the upper side of the wing, we will have the uh, devotee residences and on the lower side we will have our Sunday school facilities and phase two we will complete very hopefully very quickly the right wing of the building and our community hall um, which we want to get operational as soon as possible also so um, I, I really humbly request you all to come forward once again to help us uh, bring Sri Sri Gornitai, Sri Sitaram Lakshman Hanuman and Sri Radha Krishna to their new home in Pasipani. You know, uh, we still have a lot left to uh, uh, cover from a get funds gap perspective. Um, without pride, I can say that I personally have donated over $600,000. I know Shamkun Prabhu, Madhin Gopal Prabhu, and many others have donated such significant amounts already. And uh, I know it's a lot. I am trying to see what I can do to donate even more of my uh, retirement savings to help complete this project. And I'm appealing to all of you to support in whichever way you can. If you can make a donation, that's wonderful. If not, consider making, uh, uh, giving us an interest-free loan, which we can repay once we sell the Tawako property. Especially for all of those who have already made a pledge in the past 
and for whatever reason have not been able to fulfill your pledge, my humble appeal to you is please try to cover your pay pledge as soon as possible. The funds are needed now and they will be extremely valuable in helping us to finish this wonderful project. I just want to close by reading a small quote from Srila Prabhupada in Krishna book, chapter 81, uh, which is the Brahman Sudama blessed by Krishna. Prabhupada says, when the Lord receives a little thing in love and affection from his devotees, he considers it a great and valuable gift. I am a vivid example of this. I simply offered him a morsel of chipped rice and in exchange he has given me opulences greater than those of the King of Heaven. What the devotee actually offers the Lord is not needed by the Lord, for he is self-sufficient. If the devotee offers something to the Lord, it acts for his own interest because whatever a devotee offers the Lord comes back in a quantity a million times greater than what was offered. One does not become a loser by giving to the Lord. One becomes a gainer millions of times over. So thank you all so much for your continued support. I'm really indebted to each and every one of you who have supported this temple in one way or another over the years. And please help us get across the finish line, hopefully by next Ram Nomi, and start worshipping in this wonderful new facility, Iskona Pasipani. Hare Krishna. Jai Shri Prabhupada.